What's going on guys? Max aka Mature here, bringing you guys a hat trick tutorial for beginners. The move I'm going to teach you today are called helixes. There's actually two different types of helixes. Um, the first one is this. And the second one is when you're not holding it from the back, but instead from the brim. And it's the same movement. Um, the big difference there is uh, how many hats you're holding at the time. I know I just showed two examples only using two, but I'll explain that in a bit. Um, so starting out you're going to want two flat brimmed hats. Um, whether they're fitted like this one is or snapback, it doesn't really matter. Um, you just need two for helixes. Um, helixes are mostly used as transitional moves when you're in between different hat tricks and you're just kind of, it's, it's almost like filler, but it has a cool illusion to it, like the waving. Um, so if you have your two hats and everything, let's get started. So I'm going to show you the movement of these before actually grabbing the hats. And what the movement is, is it's kind of, uh... I don't exactly know how to describe it. Um, kind of like a digital move like this, how it kind of wraps around, almost like making a hourglass. So what you're going to do is you start with your wrists together. And then the way I do this is I move my left wrist over my right and my right comes down on an angle towards my left. Then I roll here so that my left wrist changes to face the left and then my right does the same. And then my left comes down, the right comes up and they switch and they continue that same motion. And that's the motion you're gonna be doing. And you don't, once you get good at it, your wrists don't need to be together. It's actually gonna help if they're apart a bit and so now that you guys have the motion down grab your two hats and um, the first way is when you're holding the brims this way is normally done if you only have two hats um, and so you grab it about the middle of your brim and you put your hands in that same starting position and again it's the same motion here's it slowed down so you can kind of see the position of the hats as they go around and so you want to have your hats where the actual inside is facing each other you can technically do them like this but it makes so the movements have to be farther apart so start with them together and again it's just the left goes over right goes under you switch positions and then Go the opposite way, switch, and back. Now that's if you have two hats. Say you have more hats, you aren't going to really be able to hold the brims. It would be kind of hard. So what you do is you move it to where you're holding the, uh, the backs of them, like the actual hats. Um, you want to position, position them on different fingers so they're comfortable, but now it doesn't necessarily have to be in the center. And it's the same movement, just now you can control it with more hats. And um, after that, again, another thing is to move back and forth. You're just moving to that direction and doing the same movement as you go. It gets a little harder once you have to go over your head because now you aren't looking at it exactly. But it's the same movement. Once you get good at it, like... It'll just kind of come naturally of you won't have to look at the actual hats. And again, um, once you get better at it, it's really important that you move away from this because this will actually restrict you having your wrists together. So the better you get, try to do the same movements without your wrists actually touching. And that's helixes. So I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. If you have any questions, make sure you leave them in the comments. Make sure you give this video a big thumbs up if it helped you, if you enjoyed it, share the video, and I'll see you in the next tutorial.